While it may not come as a surprise, 16GB is considered the ideal amount of RAM for gaming builds in 2022. Although the minimum requirements may suggest that 8GB is enough, it often falls short, especially if you don't have a fast SSD to complement it. Though many games don't explicitly require 16GB, having that extra memory provides the flexibility to run them without having to shut down all other apps, tabs, and launchers before you begin gaming. While some games may see a minor performance boost from extra RAM, the improvement is typically marginal and not always due to the RAM itself. This raises the question, does upgrading from 8GB to 16GB increase performance, and if so, does moving from 16GB to 32GB provide even greater benefits? However, even 16GB of RAM can sometimes feel limiting. If you're running multiple applications or doing something memory-intensive like video editing, you can quickly find yourself hitting the limits of your RAM. Upgrading from 16GB to 32GB can provide additional benefits, particularly if you're a power user who needs to multitask with demanding applications or run virtual machines. With 32GB of RAM, you have more headroom to keep multiple applications open without experiencing significant slowdowns. You can have several browser tabs, productivity apps, and media files open while simultaneously running CPU and GPU intensive tasks. While 16GB is sufficient for most users, upgrading to 32GB can future-proof your system and help you get more mileage out of your computer for years to come. As games become more advanced and demanding, some titles are already starting to push past the 16GB RAM threshold. For example, games like Microsoft Flight Simulator, Red Dead Redemption 2, and Cyberpunk 2077 can benefit from having more than 16GB of RAM, especially when playing at higher resolutions in graphics settings. Additionally, for games like BeamNG, Drive and GTA 5, where mods can greatly enhance the gameplay experience, having the extra RAM can be incredibly handy. Mods can require additional resources, and having 32GB of RAM can ensure that the game runs smoothly without any hiccups or crashes due to memory limitations. In my current setup, I have an i3-10100F processor, 16GB of Corsair RAM clocked at 3600MHz, and storage consisting of a 500GB of MEM.2 SSD and a 2TB Sparacuda HDD, and an installed of the GTX 970 graphics card. However, at times, I can sense that my 4-core CPU and 16GB RAM struggle to keep up with the demands of modern-day computing. This is in stark contrast to the past, where the i7-3770 was the go-to CPU for most high-end systems. Nowadays, 4 cores, 4 GB of video memory, and 16 GB of RAM are no longer considered top of the line, indicating that an upgrade is worth considering. RAM prices have been going down recently, and one reason for this is that companies are upgrading their technology and producing sticks with much higher megahertz ratings. As a result, lower megahertz RAMs have become cheaper and more accessible. This is great news for budget-conscious consumers, as it means that you can get a lot more RAM for your money. For example, if you're thinking of upgrading to 32GB of RAM, you can now do so without putting too much pressure on your budget. Average selling prices of dynamic random access memory dropped 20% quarter over quarter in Q1 2023 as buyers maintain conservative buying behavior, according to TrendForce. Memory quotes are set to drop even further, by 10% to 15% in Q2 2023, with DDR5 prices declining more significantly than DDR4 prices. Whether or not you decide to upgrade to 32GB RAM is entirely up to you, but I personally will be doing so. While it's possible that I may not see a major boost in FPS for all games, I'm willing to make the upgrade to avoid any potential crashes or lag during times of high pressure. I'm eager to hear your thoughts on upgrading your RAM in 2023, so please share your plans and opinions in the comments section below. Thank you for tuning in today. Take care and see you again soon.